Jean Ruverol was born in St. Louis, Missouri, the daughter of playwright Arania Ruverol, 1886-1955, who created Dandy Hardy and wrote many of the films in the MGM series. After being spotted in a high school production, Ruverol first acted in a Hollywood motion picture at the age of 17, appearing as W.C. Fields' daughter in the comedy It's a Gift, 1934. She continued to perform mainly in supporting roles, making another 11 films until 1940 when she married screenwriter Hugo Butler. With four children coming in quick order, Ruverol did not return to film acting but throughout the 1940s performed on radio, including playing Betty Carter on One Man's Family. While her husband was away serving in the U.S. military during World War II, she wrote her first novella, which she sold to McCall's magazine in 1945. By 1950, she had her first screenplay made into a film, but her career was interrupted as a result of the investigations by the House Committee on Un-American Activities HUAC, into communist influence in Hollywood. For many years Ruverol lived with actor Cliff Carpenter, who was another former blacklisted performer for many years. Carpenter died on January 9, 2014 at the age of 98. Ruverol died on March 24, 2017 at the age of 100.